and I'm assuming that no community, this is a stupid, stupid point, I just have to say, but no community has built an apartment complex over a cemetery yet, so um, we cannot use Mount Feek. Um, because I'm looking, I was looking at my map, and I'm like, oh, there's a piece of land, but I, I wonder if that's how creative they want us to become. Yeah. Well, actually, Mount Feek is out of the half mile, so okay. you couldn't use it anyway. That's why the HR1 district doesn't help us for the, or the base 1991. And, and just one other very out-of-the-box question that I, I just have to ask and I just have to ask, this isn't, this isn't a, an endorsement of anything. If we were to close one of the transit stations, let's say we're gonna close Roberts, and we will only have one transit station, what does that do to the numbers? Does that do anything? What it means is that you'd have to have the entire 1,991 in the Carter Street area. But but we. I, wouldn't I mean, need I don't think we have the authority. But we wouldn't to close need 4,000. The MBTA station anyway. It wouldn't. We still need 3,980. We still need that same number. Yes. So it's not based on the number no, of. No, that's stations? based on the number of dwelling units we have in the city currently. Okay. On, in the 2020 census, and I'd mentioned, since the 2020 census, there have been additional units added, but those aren't being placed in the calculation at this point. All right, thank you. Thank you, you Councilor.